Hey guys, this is Jess with another iPhone game review. Today I'm going to be reviewing Cannibal. Cannibal is another um, endless runner game, and uh, basically it's just 8 bit graphics that are grayscale. And you are this um, little guy who is running along the rooftops of various buildings. So it does feature some interesting um, parkour style moves if you pay close attention to it but the major complaint that I have about this game is that it's very very repetitive and for being so repetitive it has a kind of high price tag um, I think if there was more variety to this game it would be a lot better but it does fall short on the variety of gameplay. I'm not going to say that this is a bad Endless Runner, and I'm not going to say that this is a bad game in general. Um, it's fairly entertaining, but again, it's very, very repetitive. Alright, so the next game I'm going to get into is called Robot Robies. And basically, you take the um, perspective of this robot character um, whose job it is to find various items. Um, so you have two different kinds of uh, settings, and it's Gig and Recording Studio. But you cannot unlock Recording Studio without getting past certain levels of um, the gig. So it tells you what it needs you to find here and then you click rock on to move ahead. Now right off the bat I have to say that even though part of the lag is because of the video, recording um, a great deal of the lag is the game itself. Um, even when I was just playing this game um, off recording. It was fairly laggy. Um, a lot of times the um, jump button is also delayed. So the major complaint that I have for this game is that the controls are a bit um, glitchy. So for it being a timed game and being a game where pretty much all you do is um, rely on jumping and moving around it kinda takes away from the game a lot but basically it also gets pretty repetitive because all you do is find objects and it's pretty much the same thing you walk around and you jump and then you walk around and you jump some more you can also tweet your um, level completing to Twitter or post it to your wall on Facebook and here at the very end you have your score so going back if you forget how to play um, there's a help there and it will show you the um, controls as well as the gameplay in case you forget but basically that's all there is to the game. Um, if you have any questions, just ask and I will answer it to the best of my ability. And uh, let me know what you think about these games in the comments below.